It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. Derek Ray here on the commentary box, joined as always by former England defender Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Real Madrid up against Borussia Mönchengladbach. Well, the first group stage of the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw may be a good result as well. We're about to find out what happens. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Sergio Ramos plays with Rafael Varane at the back. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And leading the line today is Karim Benzema. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Vinicius Junior. Benzema. Well, he's hit it with far too much height. Well, he's quite a long way out, and if you put power on the ball and just lean back slightly, it's going to rise, and that time, over the bar. And here's how it looks for Borussia Mönchengladbach. The Swiss international, Jan Sommer, is the goalkeeper. Matthias Ginter plays with Nico Elvedi in central defence. And the striker of choice in this setup is Alassane Plea. Modric. Casemiro. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Mendy. Now with Benzema. Rafael Varane. Tony Kroos. And a goal kick is the outcome. Neuhaus. Well, possibilities in the centre. And the cross comes to nothing in the end. Vinicius Junior. Modric. Good looking ball. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Lars Stintl. Now with Elvedi. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Karim Benzema. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Modric. Opportunity to take the lead. With the game level, let's see what they can do with this corner. Favouring the short one. Fruitful looking attack. Clears it away. Well, Real Madrid possession stats are pretty good, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Corner for Real Madrid. Well, they're going for the short one. Asensio. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Well, look at Modric. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. 
Well, the counter chance looks very real. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. And players waiting in the centre. And they deal with the threat this time. Well, possession seeded. Well, getting right in their opponent's faces, forcing that hurried clearance. And a throw it'll be. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Florian Neuhaus. Alassane Plea. There's a complete understanding of the game. Luka Modric. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Oh, that's a fine pass. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Alassane Plea. On to Stindl. How can they open up the defence here? They've won back possession. Modric. Is this the moment? And he's fired it against the post. Really good high press. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Options in the centre. Look at Modric. Rob them. And he was in the right place to intercept. Firing it towards goal. And not cleared away properly. But it looked so threatening, but the danger averted. Marcus Tuham. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Tuham. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Stindl. Well, here we see it again, some lovely quality passing, fluid as you like. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? A really effective shielding under pressure. And space for the cross. Course. Real defensive commitment there. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. As you can see, the visitors haven't had too much of the ball. But when they've had the ball, they keep delivering the sucker punch. A great advert for low possession, counter-attacking football. It's really working. Substitution for Real Madrid. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Kramer in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Lucas Vasquez. Karim Benzema. 
Real Madrid have given it away. Christoph Karma. Alassane Player. Well, in the second half, trailing, albeit by a small margin. How should they be viewing this task, Lee? Well, they've not been at the best tonight, Real, for me. A little bit off colour in all departments, but they're still in this game, make no mistake about that. We used to say to each other on the pitch, if we were losing near the end of a game, we're bound to get one more chance. Let's see if they do. Mendy. going to make the change now. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. We have entered the final minute of normal time. Lucas Vasquez. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. And just slightly offside. Aiden Azar. And that brings the action to its conclusion. You've got to say, Lee, a horrible night at the office. That's the last thing you need. Start of the qualifying stages. You don't need a zero point, Sally. You almost need memory loss now to forget about that. Down to five games to qualify. And I think it's accurate to say, Lee, that this man was the light bringer for his side. He's always a man to watch for the opposition, but they couldn't keep tabs on him in that vital moment when he grabbed that goal. 